All right, I'm gonna show you how I offset my line on jugs and poles both, I do it the same way. I don't use leaders because to me, I just don't trust it. Every, every part of the line that can disconnect to me is a no-go. Um, a lot of people love to use those little double barrel swivels. Uh, that's not for me. Uh, I trust the line I get, so that's the line I wanna use. And so what you do is just pass the line through the eye, tie it off, and typically all I do is a triple knot. Pretty simple. Now, take the hook to whatever your depth, desired depth is. If it's a pole line, I like to do about two foot. If it's a jug line, I like to do about three foot. And all you're gonna do is take your fingers like so, pull it down about three, four inches, do a little loop, and keep going until you can slip that hook through there and then when you pull the hook through, bam, good to go. Now we're gonna do that one more time, but in full speed, so you can see it again. If you're like me, you like to see things twice. So we're going to slip the line through the eye, maybe. Tie a quick triple knot. All right, we're going to pull that hook up to the desired depth. Then you're going to two fingers to one, twist, slip the hook through, and pull it. I've used this many a many a times, and even whenever this the weight comes off, this does not come loose. Uh, Keystone Ketter showed me this, and I've used it ever since whenever I want to fish close to bottom, but uh, I'm in rocky areas, this is what I do.